Hi everyone, my name is Eileen O'Sullivan. I'm an artist and I work with the National Gallery of Ireland. I look forward to welcoming you to the sensory drawing class for adults as part of the National Gallery of Ireland's Drawing Day programme. This video is a little information video to tell you what you'll need on the day and a little um, brief overview of what will happen during the hour, what we'll be working on so that you can be prepared and gather the materials that you'd like to have on the day. For the workshop you will need some art materials and you'll need to select some objects. Here are some examples of what you might like to collect. You'll need one sheet of paper to draw on. Uh, you could use white paper, coloured paper, maybe something from the recycling bin like an old envelope or some cardboard. You'll need some colouring materials, a pencil and some colours, maybe markers, crayons, colouring pencils, whatever you have at home is perfect. And you'll need some materials from the kitchen that will give our drawing nice colours, nice smells, nice textures. So here I've laid out um, a variety of materials that you might like to collect. You can be inventive and select your own from what you have in the kitchen. Some sugar that we can glue on to make a shiny texture. You could use soy sauce that can be used like ink. A tea bag that will colour the paper a nice browny tone. Maybe you'd like to use coffee or cocoa. An overview of the class. The class will start by setting up our drawing. Um, I would recommend you have a, a light or a lamp to place beside your objects because this makes the objects have a nice shadow and a nice shape which also makes it a little bit easier to draw them. We'll spend some time uh, setting up the objects and then we will go through the steps of drawing the outline of the objects, filling in some more detail, starting on the colour, looking at what colours are in the objects. Then we'll move on to some more detailed colours, colour studies and um, by the time we get to the end of our drawing we will be able to add some textures and colours from the kitchen as well such as the coffee, the sugar, the tea and have a bit of fun with those elements. When you're selecting your objects my advice is to select objects that are natural rather than man-made. Vegetables, fruit, things that are made from paper like the bag of flour, things that have a shape that changes rather than objects that are glass or metal or ceramic as objects that are more natural are easier to draw because they are more forgiving to mistakes. Objects that are man-made are, are very harsh and harder to draw so you can select whatever objects you like. Tree is more than enough. Um, it's all about having fun and um, enjoying drawing so I hope that we can have a lovely experience together on the day.